Hi everybody, what's going on on this beautiful Monday night in Rochester, New York and all over the world. I hope everyone is doing good. I hope everyone is still taking care of themselves and practicing being safe. Let's get into it, Rochester and all over. This is your girl here tonight. We're about to talk about it. I have so many messages, so many text messages sitting up here. We're gonna talk about all of them. We're gonna get all of them out. So let's get into this. So these are so good. Listen, must be 18 years of age. Just get somebody's consent just to clear my conscience because I'm not holding back. I'm gonna tell you the way it is. I'm gonna tell you what your man or your girl is doing. This works for a man, this works for women. Rewind my video if you're having trouble understanding. So let's get into it. Now, the first question that was sent to me was, your man, this is a girl. So, she wanted to know why her man that's with her and a lot of you weren't gonna like this but i'm gonna tell you the way it is and this is what the fuck your man is looking at yeah you could be skinny you could be small you could have short hair you could have long hair it doesn't fucking matter your man left you he cheated on you with the rebound she could be 500 pounds, okay? The women you're making fun of is the rose he's kissing, the, the person he's cuddling with that night. Um, you're so insecure wearing your t-shirt every day when you have sex or you're worried about what's hanging out or what's showing. He don't give a fuck about that. Your man loves you. These are the reasons why he's not with you because you're fucking picking and choosing. Stop being so critical about yourself in front of him and your man won't leave you for the next bitch. Yes, this is Angela Speranza. I am here tonight on this Monday night in Rochester, New York, all over the world. We are talking about it. We are going raw. So let's get back into it. 585-296-1334. That's just a regular number. You can reach me at any time, any day. I always get back to my viewers and subscribers. If it's not that day, I get back to you. So let me get back to that. Woo! This is good, everybody. Okay. So I'm so hyper. I'm so happy to do this for you. So yes, your man is looking at the chick that you call fat. Your man is looking at the chick that you pick on when you are together in public with him or behind closed doors. Yes, he's loving her. He's sucking her. He's fucking her. He's loving every single spot of her body. That's the way it is. So if you are a man, okay, listen, pay attention because you think you're all that when you're with your girl. She's looking at the next motherfucker. She's looking at how the next girl's being treated. Your girl comes to you and asks you a question. It could be any question. Your example, I'm going to give you an example. Your example is, do you think she's prettier than me? Why the fuck are you going to ask your man that? When I was reading that message in the work phone, I'm like, damn, they must be going through it. So, yes, he thinks she's prettier than you. He's talking to her. He's with her. He finds something attractive about her. Let me tell you something. A man does not think a woman is ugly. A woman knows how to get it together. She knows how to clean herself up. She knows how to look good for him. That's why he's going back. And I always say it. They always leave the door open. But. This is so good. I had to like pause for 30 seconds because I had to think of like what to say because I'm so happy to do this video for you. So let's get back into it. Yes. Your man is loving the next. She could be fat, she could be short, she can be tall, she can be rhinoceros, she can be anorexic. Nothing against anybody of these sizes or these shapes because um, your girl, hello, boom. Your girl is a thick girl. So I'm just saying, yes, 
Your man loves all that. Stop trying to cover up. What the fuck are you covering up? When you met him, you weren't covered up. You had your hair and your makeup done, something pretty on, something nice. And that's what he liked. That's what he adored. If you stop doing your hair, go back and fucking do it. If you stop wearing makeup and your man told you that you look better without him, bitch, you know you don't look good with makeup. You need to put some makeup back on. Got a little hype. Got to calm down. Go put that makeup back on immediately, okay? Because you're sitting there looking like... And he's out with the next, partying, living la vida loca. He's living the amazing life. Listen, take care of yourself. If you are wondering why your man or woman, this goes for man and women. If you're having trouble, rewind my video, flip it, switch it. It works for both. These are the things that he and she likes. I don't know if I figured finish the woman part for the man um if you don't take your girl out somebody else will if you don't make your girl feel special somebody else will if you don't tell your girl she's pretty or beautiful or i'm not saying you have to buy her flowers but that's a bonus i'm not saying you have to get her candy but that's a bonus women like to be treated the way they treat you if you have a girl and she's doing everything for you she's cooking she's cleaning up she's cleaning when you ask her on demand she's going to the store when you ask her on demand she's doing everything you say and you don't want to treat her the way she deserves to be treated then you don't deserve her you can't get mad at her if she's going to get it from the next Write into me. Let me know how you feel about that, Rochester 585-296-1334. Or hit me up right here live on the tube. You know how it is. I will respond to you on the tube. So let's keep it funky, okay? So, but those are just some things. Like, you see your girl staring at the next man, and you guys are together. I'm going to give you an example. Now pay attention. Um, you're in the car, let's say. And you see your girl staring at the next man. And she sees him doing something fun. Doing something that she wants to do with you. That's your fault. You can't get mad at her. She's wishing that she could be doing that with you. All right. Let's get back into it. Let's say another question. Now, this one is... She took her she took her man back, she said to me, and she wanted to know why is he so cold to her? He's hot and cold every other day. It'd be my pleasure to tell you why. The reason why your man is so cold to you after you took him back is because you're letting him get away with everything again. He's talking to you a certain way, he's coming at you a certain way, he's treating you a certain way, and that's what's going on. That's what's happening. Nip it in the butt today. Nip it in the butt now. There's a way you can do it. You can be polite about it. You can have a nice rational conversation. You can both be sitting down. You can both be calm. Because let me tell you something. He's mirroring you. He's going off your vibe. He's going off your energy. So when you come at him aggressive, He's going to come at you harder. When you come at him with disrespect, he's going to dog you and disrespect you. Come at him calm. Talk to him like a man. Treat him like a man that he is. And if he don't like it, you pick your shit up and you walk the fuck out. I am Angela Sperenza. I am the love coach of Roger Stewart all over the world. I hope everyone is having a good time tonight. I am. It is 538 in Rochester, New York. I'll show you the time real quick. I don't know if you guys saw it. Okay, so anyways. Yeah. Aren't these so good? I have another one that I want to talk about. But that's why he's hot and cold. Okay? This works for a man. This works for women. Women do the same thing. If you are a man and you are experiencing this, she's not going to tell you so many times. After the third and fifth and eighth time, she's not going to tell you anymore she's going to become distant. She's going to start going out. She's going to start hanging out with her friends. 
She's going to do all the things that you didn't want to do with her because you were afraid to be out with her in public. For what? For, for someone to see? That's why your man's not taking you out because he has other bitches. He has other people that are watching and he don't want them to see. He don't want to take you out because he don't want to spend his money on you. You aren't good enough. That's the way it is. And if you are a woman and you are paying every day to chill with your man, he has a car, you're helping him out with gas. You're helping him out with food, um, a place. What the fuck? No, that's not going to happen. 585-296-1334. Hit me up. I will tell you how to handle it. I will help you. I will give you 100% guidance on what's going on in your situation and what the deal really is. So I hope everyone enjoyed these, answering these questions. These were special to me. These were dear. And I had to help you. I had to let you know the way it is. And if you are going through any of this, you know, hit your girl up. I'm here for you. Always. I love love. And true love always wins in the end regardless of what the next person says. Be safe.